Recently, Microsoft Windows has made some major changes in the settings for Windows Inc. And these changes can affect Photoshop and your drawing tablet. For example, one of my viewers, Terry, says, for some reason, my pen basically grabs the page and moves it up or down, but it draws left and right. I've tried everything I can think of. When I have Windows Inc. on, it moves the page. If I don't have Windows Inc. on, then there is no pressure. Help! This is a bug that Wacom is aware of, and they have a solution for fixing it. I'll go ahead and walk you through all the steps. So what's happening here is if you draw left or right, you can draw a line. But if you try to draw up or down, then it ends up panning your page. And again, this is a Windows Ink bug, not a Wacom tablet bug. So essentially, all we need to do is turn off Windows Ink, and that sounds simple enough, right? But as Terry mentioned, if we turn off Windows Ink, then we don't get any pen pressure because Photoshop is dependent on Windows Ink for pen pressure. Or is it? So let's go ahead and look in our Wacom tablet properties. Now this setting could be in a few different places depending on the model of tablet that you have. I have the Cintiq 27 QHD Touch. So I'm going to click on my Pro Pen here. And then under Calibrate is where I will find Use Windows Ink. So I'm going to uncheck that. Now if we close out Wacom Tablet Properties and we go back to Photoshop, now I'm able to draw, but I have no pen pressure. I can't make my line thinner or wider depending on how hard I press down. And that's not good. So what we need to do is we need to sort of hack Photoshop in order to use the WinTab drivers rather than using Windows Ink. So I'm going to go ahead and minimize Photoshop for a second here. I'm going to right click on my desktop and I'm going to create a new text document. I'll go ahead and just double click on that to open it. And within that text file, we want it to say use system stylus, all one word with each word capitalized, space zero. And we want to go ahead and save this. And we want to name this file PS user config, and it should be a TXT file. Now we want to locate a folder on our computer. I'll go ahead and do a search for Adobe Photoshop on my computer. And the folder that we want is called Adobe Photoshop CC settings. That's found in users, app data, roaming, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop. Within that folder, we'll just simply move that text file we created into it. Now we'll want to, of course, close Photoshop and then reopen it. And now if we draw, we have pen pressure. And if we go back to our Wacom tablet properties and we look under Calibrate, Windows Ink is disabled and everything's good. Now, I wasn't having this problem, but I'm actually pretty psyched about this because I don't like using Windows Ink and I'd prefer to have it turned off. And now I can use Photoshop without needing Windows Ink to be on. So this is great. If this video helped you, take a quick second to click the like button. And if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe because I have lots of useful digital art videos like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.